Hello and welcome to a Classic FM Christmas with me, Charlotte Hawkins. I'm delighted to be joining you all here in this gorgeous venue, St John Smith Square in the heart of Westminster in London. Today we're going to be hearing exclusive live performances of traditional carols and festive favourites, as well as some fresh new arrangements, all performed by some of today's most talented young musicians. Stand by for a real musical treat. That was Once in Royal David City, sung by the young voices of Genesis 16, conducted by Harry Bradford. And you can really feel the atmosphere in this magnificent building, which has stood here now for nearly 300 years. Since its construction, this beautiful Baroque church has survived a fire, lightning, bomb plots, and a monumental attack during the Blitz in 1941, which completely gutted its interior. St John's lay as a ruin for nearly 30 years, and there was even talk of turning it into a car park. Finally, in the late 1960s, enough funds were raised to transform the ruin into this spectacular concert venue we see today. And over the last 50 years, great international musicians from conductor Simon Rattle and cellist Jacqueline Dupre to American composer Eric Whittaker have graced this stage. Today, it remains a home for the most beautiful music. Every Christmas, St John Smith Square comes alive with song at their annual Christmas festival, where you can hear great works like Handel's Messiah. But now for some more carols, and up next, a Christmas classic. <laughs>
That was In the Bleak Midwinter, followed by the traditional Ukrainian carol, Carol of the Bells. This is the fabulous sound of a classic FM Christmas. And there's plenty more superb music to come, so do stay watching.
That was a beautiful arrangement of Wexford Carol performed by the Carducci Quartet. Now I have some more fabulous carols on the way from the young choir you've already heard, Genesis 16. But first, here's some Bach, played on the great organ of St John Smith Square.
that was Bach's Prelude and Fugue in A Major, played there by the brilliant organist Anna Lapwood. Anna is one of our finest young musicians and one who, at the age of just 24, holds a particularly impressive title. After becoming the first ever female organ scholar at Magdalen College, Oxford, Anna, who can play over 15 instruments, is now the Director of Music at Pembroke College, Cambridge. Just take a moment to let that sink in. Well, back to the music now, and next up, I have a fresh new arrangement of a timeless Christmas tune. Beautiful. That was British composer and pianist Thomas Hewitt Jones performing his own arrangement of the enduring Christmas carol Silent Night. And I tell you what, this really is a fabulous venue to be in at this time of year. Every year, St John Smith Square puts on the glory of Christmas, a wonderful evening of musical celebration held in support of a charity of their choice. The concerts typically feature stunning voices such as those of Christ College Cambridge recently, singing music by Bach and Handel, as well as our favourite traditional carols. Speaking of carols, I think it's time we heard some more of those, don't you?
Such a poignant piece of music there. Those were the sublime voices of Genesis 16, singing Victoria's Omania Mysterium, followed by a stunning choral cool version of Silent Night, especially for us here at St John Smith Square. For me, there is nothing like the glorious sound of a choir at this time of year. Genesis 16 is a wonderful group of young singers who are all aged 18 to 23 years old. It was founded by the great Harry Christophers, supported by the Genesis Foundation as the Young Artist Scheme for his wonderful choir, The 16, all with the aim of nurturing the next generation of ensemble singers. Applications are open to any young singers around the country, so if you're a young singer or you know someone who loves choral music, do have a look at their scheme. Now, whether you've got your feet up on the sofa with a cup of something warm in hand, or you're out and about on a chilly commute, I do hope you're enjoying this exclusive Christmas concert from Classic FM. And next up, I've got something a bit more lively to get us in the festive mood. Past three o'clock and the cold frosty morn. Past three o'clock, good morning, masters all. Born is a baby, gentle as may be, son of the eternal Father Superman. Past three o'clock and a cold frosty morning, past three o'clock, good morning, masters all. Said of Christ, he is angel buried. Time it and shine it. Past three o'clock and a cold frosty morning. Past three o'clock, good mother masters all. She's from the dead, we bring day for Mary, and not for money, but a hand on And a cold frosty morning, past three o'clock, good morning, masters all. Night out of sun and leaders from far land, princes to meet in worship and greet them. Past three o'clock, and a cold frosty morning, past three o'clock, good morning, masters all. Thus may I pray you, upsets of stay till ye confess in 
likewise and bless him. Pass three o'clock and a cold frosty morn. Pass three o'clock, good night, a master's horn. was past three o'clock with words by George Ratcliffe Woodward, followed by Peter Warlock's Bethlehem Down. And I think there might just be time for one more carol. Triumph of the skies with 
That was Hark the Herald Angels Sing, performed by our young choir Genesis 16. What a stunning performance to end our Christmas concert. A special thanks to Genesis 16, conductor Harry Bradford, Anna Lapwood, Thomas Hewitt-Jones and the Carducci Quartet for providing us with a beautiful festive soundtrack. With particular thanks to St John's Smith Square for providing such a beautiful venue for them to perform in. Thank you so much for joining us today for A Classic FM Christmas. From me, Charlotte Hawkins, and all of us at Classic FM, have a very Merry Christmas. Thank you.